Mahalo everyone and welcome to the Johnny Scarecrows channel. You're with me Joe and today I'm bringing you a Scrap Kaiju deck. Um, the whole idea behind this deck is basically to use the kind of Kaijus to interrupt your opponent's uh, board and hopefully bait out as many of the negates as they have and then use the one or two cards you need to start the Scrap Engine off and hopefully that will um, cascade into a whole bunch of uh, different extra deck monsters. Um, it's quite um, intricate to pull off, but when you do, um, it's really good. And there's so much searchability in the deck that it's actually quite nice. So in your opening hand, um, what you really want to have is this thing, Scrap Raptor. So Scrap Raptor has two effects. Uh, the first is that you can target a card and destroy it, and you get to normal summon another scrap. And the second effect is that when this card is destroyed by a scrap card, you can search a scrap from your deck. So you can kind of see what the opening play is going to be. Normal summon this out and target itself and destroy itself. And that way you get both an additional normal summon of a scrap monster and you get to add a scrap card from your deck to your hand. At this point, you want to have um, both the field spell, scrap factory and uh, scrap chimera. So we'll go with Scrap Factory first of all. Basically, if your, uh, a Scrap Monster gets destroyed by a card effect, uh, you get to special summon one Scrap Monster from your deck. So uh, you can see already, even if you get this in your opening hand, obviously play it before you start your Scrap Raptor combo off. But sometimes you'll have to search for it with the effect of Scrap Raptor. Um, the, uh, the Scrap Chimera, when it's normal summoned, lets you special summon a Scrap Tuner um, from your graveyard, and actually, you're probably not going to be synchro summoning it too much. You can immediately go into Scrap Dragon. Scrap Chimera locks you into the scraps, so sometimes you can just be like, well, I'll go to Scrap Chimera, but really what you end up going into is the Link Monsters. And the specific Link Monster you go into is the Scrap Wyvern. So Scrap Wyvern lets you um, special summon a Scrap Monster and then destroy a card you control. So what you're going to try and uh, destroy is another copy of Scrap Raptor. Um, and <laughs> this basically then triggers the other effect of Scrap Wyvern, which is that if a Scrap Monster is destroyed by a card effect, you can special summon a Scrap Monster from your deck, um, a little bit similar to the Raptor. What are you going to try and bring out? You're going to try and bring out this beast, Scrap Golem. Uh, it's a five star, um, so it's a bit annoying if you get it in your hand. But so the way you really want to get it out is by the special summon effect of Scrap Wyvern. And this lets you target a level 4 or lower Scrap Monster in your grave and special summon it to either player's field. Um, and unless you've got a sneaky combo, which we'll go on about in a bit later, set up, what you want to be doing is special summon it to your field. And you can basically just keep going and going with these kind of effects. Um, so you can only use the effect of Scrap Wyvern once per turn, but basically you can build these up so you can quite easily get out two copies of Scrap Golem because um, the effect of Scrap Factory um, kicks into place whenever, and whenever that effect triggers, you're going to want to also bring out the effect of Scrap Golem. Scrap Factory also has the effect of giving you a Scrap Monster's 200 attack and defense. It doesn't sound like much, but um, when you're dealing with things like this, Scrap Golem can go up to 2500, which is nice, can get over certain things. Scrap Chimera comes into a 1900 beta. So you're, you've, you've got quite a few monsters set up. You can also search for Scrap Recycler. Um, this lets you send a machine monster from your deck to the graveyard. And the one you want to be targeting with that is maybe a Despot 01. And then if you are later in your special summoning shenanigans, able to bring out things like Cult Wing, um, you can really easily bring out things like the Mecha Phantom Beast uh, Auradon. That lets you special summon a load of tokens, that'll let you summon a load of despots, and you can quite easily go to the high rank link monsters. Um, your alternative plan is you can go into Halberfrax. Halberfrax will let you search for the deck's uh, effect bailer, and because you've searched for Scrap Factory, you're going to have the spell on the um, on the field that will allow you to go from the Halberfrax and the effect bailer into the Selene. Uh, the Selene with that extra spell card will allow you to go into a Link 4, something like an Access Code Talker or an Apple, uh, Apple Oessa, easy for me to say. Um, and then you're, you're set up to negate your opponent's counterattacks. 
Um, with your your scraps that you've summoned, you can go into um, if it's not if you haven't got Chimera on the field, you can go into uh, Vermilion Dragon Mech. If you do, you can go into things like Scrap Dragon, um, which again lets you target cards uh, you and your opponent controls to destroy them. And if this is in subsequent turns, then um, you're right there, ready to. Uh, destroy them. You're using the kaiju engine, of course, so often what you'll be trying to do is kaiju your opponent's monsters, and then that will be the one you're targeting with Scrap Dragon to destroy. Um, the the last thing, I guess, to, to mention, or one of the last things to mention, is that we're, we're main decking three copies of Remove Brainwashing. Um, this is more for the memes, honestly, so if um, you'll probably want to maybe add another copy of Ash or Infinite Impermanent, something like that, if you're going to play this as competitively as the deck could be. But honestly, it's very funny when you've kaijued your opponent's monster or you've given them scraps and then you just remove brainwashing them back. Um, that's something I really enjoy doing. Um, what are other underrated cards in the deck? Fossil Dig. Fossil Dig as a one level six or lower dinosaur monster from your deck to your hand. Scrap Raptor. I personally thought it was a machine. No, it's, uh, it's a dinosaur monster. So Fossil Dig turns into a Scrap Raptor. So you're... Along with Scrap Yard, which lets you search for a Scrap Tuner mod from your deck to your hand, you have nine copies of Scrap Raptor. So odds are you should have one of these in your opening hand. Um, you'd be really unlucky not to have one. And with other searches like Terraforming and, and Set Rotation, um, this deck can also play Mystic Mine. In fact, it's currently in the side, and that's one deck, one card it should be added in if you are going to be using Set Rotation. Um, you, uh, because you can then kaiju your opponent's monsters and you know, set up your board after that. And you'll be uh, able to destroy your own cards once you get out the higher level scraps. Um, yeah, I think that's all there is to say on this deck. Uh, go and try it out. Um, it works really nicely. If you haven't been using Go Second decks, uh, I kind of recommend it because a lot of people like really nice and expressive first turn decks but using a go second deck can be uh, just as much fun if not more fun in my opinion i um, don't know why i'm ending it on monster reborn i should end it on uh, the wonderful scrap raptor thank you very much for watching see you for the next video on the joey scarecrow's channel